Hey guys, Prank on Gaming here, and today I'm going to be giving you a Millwall analysis video. Now, this was the FA Cup game against AFC Fylde. Now, there wasn't so many highlights, but I'll start by saying the AFC Fylde's kit was fantastic. Of course, you know I love the colour orange, and yes, it was a beautiful kit. Now, the first chance that we had in the game was we came close with a free kick that was taken by Joe Martin. It's important that I say the right player. And then Irwin made a great save to deny us there. But then Morrison came very close to scoring, but he just put it wide. And Morrison has started to score a lot more goals recently. Now, we did, in fact, score our first goal, but of course it was in the second half. And it was from Aidan O'Brien. Now, what he did was he ran onto the ball, headed it down so he'd have it in front of him. And then he went and placed it to the left of the goalkeeper. It was a very well taken goal and it was a fantastic finish showing Aidan O'Brien's class. And that was now 1-0 to Millwall. Then we did score again. So we started to get even better in the lead. And it was from Sean Williams' help. He kept moving with the ball. He placed it into the path of Lee Gregory who nutmegged the defender and placed the ball to the far right corner. So this time it's a little bit different to where Aidan O'Brien's goal went. And it was then 2-0. However, Millwall do have a fact where every now and then they will concede a goal. And against a smaller side, sometimes we get complacent. I don't know if we actually gave the goal away to them because they came down to the den and they were having a great time and they just wanted to play against us. But either way, they did score a goal and it was a very, very good goal, let me add. The ball was played into the air for Alex Whittle. Now, he blasted the ball onto Webster and it bounced back off of Webster. He then smashed the ball and it hit against the post. And as it hit against the post, it bounced into the back of the net. And it, basically, it beat Ford easily. And it was then 2-1. And I've got to say, it was a very, very nice goal. I really did like the goal. Now, the next goal that was scored was again Millwall. And now, this was the last goal in the game. And it was the play was actually started from Aiden O'Brien. And he just ran past all the defenders. He's very, very quick and very talented. Now, when he ran past... He then played the ball out wide to Steve Morrison, who then came inside the area and he tucked the ball into the back of the net and made it 3-1. So there you go, there were the goals. Now, what about the key players for each team? Well, of course, for Millwall, it would be Aiden O'Brien because he basically changed the game coming on in the second half, of course, because he did score that goal and he did set up the goal and he was basically one of the better players going forward in the second half. And if it weren't for him, we may have struggled to win that game. Now, in terms of AFC Fulham's player, it is Alex Whittle. Because he scored that goal for them, well, he's definitely the most important player that they had on that pitch. And all I've got to say is congratulations to him for scoring that goal. And it was a very well-taken goal. Now, the draw for the FA Cup has actually happened. So, Mill have been drawn against Wickham Wanderers in the the round two of the FA Cup. So that'll be an interesting tie. Hopefully we should go on to win it. I would expect so, but who knows? Sometimes we do mess up in cup games. But all I can say is we really need to focus on cementing that playoff place, if not promotion, because we are definitely strong enough and we are showing that. Now the next game that Millwall are playing is against Plymouth Argyle of League Two in the Johnson's Paint Trophy. Now that'll be a great game tonight and I'm hoping that we can come away and actually win that and progress even further. Of course, both sides do have some crucial injuries that could affect the game either way. But I don't know what's going to happen in that game. It'll be interesting. I'll be listening to it. Hopefully, we can get a win. So anyway, guys, I hope you have enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. And of course, I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.